Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mini Diaries. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Today, I'm back at the unit. I'm waiting for the boys to turn up. So I thought I've got an opportunity to give you a bit of an update. I hope you enjoyed my last video, which was Mini Fair up at Bingley Hall in Stafford. It was a banging show with some top quality minis there, all proper, nice and clean. It gave me lots of inspiration. It gave me lots of chances to capture some nice footage too. So that was a good show. And I hope you can go back and watch it if you haven't already. The first update I've got for you is about my mini and the gearbox. It doesn't sound as if it's running right to me. I'll put a little clip in. It seems to be whining quite a lot and I did notice some swarf coming up on the sump plug so I'm looking to drop my gearbox and replace it with one from a friend. He's been nice enough to lend me his one and keep me going for a little bit longer whilst I re rebuild mine into straight cuts. Um, please stay tuned for that. I'm gonna get all the boys down. We're gonna get the engine out, the gearbox off, do a few bits and hopefully do it all over one weekend because there's Brooklyn's coming up on the 24th of February, I think it is. Um, I'm gonna be on the stand with a car kitchen, hopefully, if I can get all of this done. It doesn't seem too much work and it does make it a lot easier with a removable front. Which brings me on to my next little update. The camera's stood on Alex's Mini at the moment. Um, he's going to be cutting the front end off of that. And in the meantime, I'm going to do a video about taking mine off and how the removable front flip works. A lot of people seem to ask me, so I'm going to try and incorporate in that in one of the future videos. So please stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button as well. The next updates that I've got for you are the tuning day and the quarter mile mini meet up at Santa Pod, both coming up and getting closer. As I said, the Brooklyn's on the 24th. I think his quarter mile mini is on the 30th. And then on the 6th of April is our tuning day. Please get in contact with me um, if you want to come down and and have a nosy about and get to meet some of the mini heads around me. It'd be great if you wanted to come along and get involved. Just send me a message. Um, that then puts me on to the other one of the Cheddar Gorge meet while we're out in Bristol. A lot more people are going than what I thought. So there may be a few little different sort of plans on that, but I'll keep you on, I'll, but I'll keep you but I'll keep you updated on that as I go along and see how full send I've got to make it because there is quite a few people interested. So head over to Facebook and have a look at that. Click interested or go in. If you're going, press go in because numbers is going to be quite a lot and it'll be cool to know so I can contact some authorities maybe. Um, but yeah, head over to Facebook if you're interested in that. Have a look on my page, Mini Dobby, and the events. It's one of them that's listed on there. Um, today I'm wearing Little Car Society's hoodie. Head over to his Instagram, I'll leave that down here. Go and check out his merch. Uh, have a look at his Instagram. He puts up some banging photos, mainly minis. He does have a really nice mini himself, so he is a creator as well as a brand. Um, he decided to swap me for a couple of t-shirts for a hoodie. So head over to my shop on the Facebook button or I'll leave a link down below in the description. Head over to there, go and have a look at my t-shirts, grab some stickers. It's all going to be supporting me. I'm going to throw it all back into my equipment and also some road trips that I'm collating behind the scenes at the moment too. So please head over to there and have a look for me. Um, I think that's about it for my updates. The only thing I've got left is to do a bit more work on Bugs car. I've got a spray up in the arch and in the boot. We spilt a little bit of petrol, which wasn't too clever. Rick's also doing his head gasket. 
Alex is going to be doing his front end, so there's loads going to be going on, guys. I hope you're enjoying the new content of us and the boys peeing about, doing our mini thing in our mini world. I love it, and I hope that you are too. So I'm really enjoying sharing it with you. So let's get cracking and see what happens. So we've got our first guest of the evening. Rick's decided to turn up. Not a guest. <laughs> he is part of the unit, but guest on the channel. Hopefully see some more of him too. He's down here playing with his carb. We've still got Alex to turn up and Bug to come and finish off his suspension. But for now, let's see how Rick takes his carb apart. Wait, why is he doing it? Because it's... No, I see that bit there. That bit. That goes up and down. Yeah, it? when you adjust it, it doesn't go up and down. You get stuck. Oh. So that's it for me tonight guys, didn't get much done, I got the wheels back on Bugs car, you can just see the arch gap there, that's pretty funny, it's setting up nice and high, Alex did end up coming down, Rick had the ump, he had an headache and Bug popped in briefly, you see our car, how high his car was sitting, and then he went home, I don't know if he was happy or not. So I'll bring the cameras down with me next time I'm down. Hopefully everyone's in a bit more of a better mood. We're all working. It isn't very warm down here. So we're still getting little bits done at a time. So stay tuned for some more mini action coming up soon. <laughs> 